today, we're going to go to Capitol Reef, Utah. It's going to be a six hour and two minute drive. If you like nature, road trips, and adventure, please subscribe and like this video. Capitol Reef is supposed to be one of the less crowded parks in Utah, and we are going at night to try to do some Milky Way photography. So I'm super excited about that because I love doing night photography. We start our day in Idaho Falls, ready to embark on a 426 mile trip to Capitol Reef. A few bumps in the road since a pebble chipped our windshield, but when you're on a road trip, that's the kind of thing that can happen. We also hit the 3,000 mile mark. Today is the Broken Spur Inn in Torrey, Utah, south of Salt Lake City. During our trip, we see some breathtaking scenery, which is such a contrast from our previous day in Montana. From rainy, mountainy, and green to arid with reddish mountains and imposing rock formations, Utah is certainly an amazing place. to the Broken Spur Inn in Torrey, Utah. This hotel has great food, beautiful views, and great service. It instantly became one of our favorite places to stay in the whole trip. Just five minutes from Capitol Reef Scenic Drive, this hotel has it all. Right outside our hotel room, there's an amazing view of the canyon lands, and there's also an outdoor glass-enclosed pool with beautiful views and chuck wagons for the kids to look at. Also, this hotel has an incredible restaurant. The steak we had here is by far one of the best ones we've ever had. Sometimes when people, when I say we're going to Capitol Reef, they're like, what's that? But this is an amazing national park. And we're gonna go right at sunset and stay until dark. So, so excited. Cool. Located in South Central Utah in Red Rock County, Capitol Reef is filled with canyons, domes, and other incredible geological formations. The main geological feature is a 100-mile monocline, which is basically a special kind of really tall and long ridge. In this park, you can do hiking, exploring, stargazing, or just a plain old drive through the canyon. There is so much you can do in this amazing place. What I liked best about this park was that it was less crowded than the other parks on our trip. So we actually got to experience the peacefulness of being one with nature. They also have a chimney rock, which includes a three and a half mile trail, which is relatively short and not too steep. And at the end, you're rewarded with a spectacular panoramic view. is considered the heart of Capitol Reef and it's where you're going to find the Fremont culture petroglyphs. These are carvings of animals and people done over a thousand years ago. They're super adorable and you can see them really well if you use your telephoto lens or binoculars. Getting here is super easy and very accessible. You just have to keep driving and you will see the boardwalks close to the road. It's a unique experience. So make sure to admire them from a distance, since any acts of vandalism are illegal and punishable by law. I'm trying to locate it with my eyeballs. Hmm. Oh, I see where it's supposed to be. Oh, I see them. Right there. Oh my god, they're adorable! Can I give me your camera? I'll get them. Can I use it? They're so cute. I love them. They're super cute. After a great sightseeing drive, we were ready for some Milky Way photography. What an amazing way to finish off such an incredible day and an unforgettable part of our journey. This park has one of the clearest and darkest night skies you will ever see. Late at night, we parked and took pictures and just watched in amazement for hours. 
It was like the whole world stopped spinning just for us to admire and have one of the most memorable nights of our lives. Gabby was a little concerned about snakes and mountain lions, but they didn't end up being a problem. The rewards for this incredible moment of watching the moon rise over the mountain were incalculable. Time to go back to the hotel. Tomorrow we're driving to Goblin State Park in Utah and then Frisco, Colorado. There's not a moment in life worth living if we can't enjoy the beauty that surrounds us. Go out, live, enjoy, and explore. Don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching.